Hi everyone, Mr. Hawkins with Hawkins Tech. And in this video, I'm going to talk about Apple Mail app versus Spark Mail versus Canary Mail and help you decide which mail app you should use. I'm going to be comparing both Apple Mail, Spark Mail, and Canary Mail all in this video. I did some research on the three mail apps just so that I can make this video. And we're going to start with Apple Mail. Apple Mail is good if you want to have seamless integration across all of your Apple devices. So if you have a Mac, an iPad, or an iPhone, you can have smooth, seamless integration across all of your devices. That's the one good advantage of Apple Mail and how good it works. Now, Spark Mail, on the other hand, is good to collaborate. So if you want to collaborate with the different emails, comment back and forth. This is what this app is good for. You can collaborate using this app. Now, I don't know a lot about this app, but what I do know from the, re from the information I've researched, you can collaborate using SparkMail. I believe it does have some AI features, but it's not much like Canary Mail. Canary Mail has a lot of AI features, although the majority of them are not free. With Canary Mail, you have AI capabilities, and also you have a lot of privacy and other features as well. As far as which mail app you should use, well, it really depends. If you want an app that's good for seamlessly connecting to all of your devices, iPhone, Mac, and iPad, then I would say Apple Mail is good for you. Now, if you want to use an app that you can collaborate with other people via email or comments, then Spark Mail is a good option also. However, if you want some AI features, privacy, and security, Canary Mail is a good app to use as well. Now, if I did get any information wrong, please comment down below as I'm still researching some of these apps. But personally, I like Apple Mail and Canary Mail as the new redesign is coming to Apple Mail. And really quickly, if you want to know how to change your mail, sort of make a third party mail app your default mail app, you would go into settings. Then you scroll all the way to your apps and go to default apps. At the very top here, we have email client. And since I have a couple of them, Canary, Gmail, Mail, Outlook, and Spark Mail, I have the Apple Mail app as my default. If I wanted to change it to Spark, then I can change it to Spark Mail. But I'm going to keep it at Apple Mail as that's the most common one that we use for our Apple products, although Canary, Gmail, Outlook, and Spark are also very good as well. If you liked this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Mr. Hawkins with Hawkins Tech, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.